Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Vampire the Masquerade Redemption. Last time we uh, finished going through the monastery, we found out that Mercurio, who was Garanol's uh, second in command, his child, his like, basically, yeah, second in command, uh, wanted to utilize the Book of Nod to learn the secrets and kind of take over the, the clan. Um, but we stopped him after many, many, many attempts. And uh, our, uh, basically, we're on our way back to the university as dawn is about to break, but not before stopping off at the convent and talking to Ineska who gave us the amulet of St. Jude that we gave to her, the one that we found in the Silver Mines. And we saw this woman Libusa, who, what did she say? I walked and under my feet the floor did quiver. I looked and beheld that I trod upon the bloated belly of one even more wretched than I. So she, I think she's a vampire. Beggar. Uh, Christoph, you need to heal. Or, well, I'm sorry, you need to heal. Mm. And, uh, probably actually need to feed as well. Stuff needs to feed as well. I will take the girl. That's very sexual, eh? Alright, and we're good. Okay, so... Yeah. Bring it to a cat's rain. Okay, so let's head back... Is the university this way? No. It was this way. No, that's where we came from. I'm so lost. Hang on. Hang on. The convent. University Haven. Okay. So we need to go right then right. Right then right. There it is. This is most excellent, Wilhelm. Our alliance with the Cappadocians shall strengthen when I reveal Mercurio's treachery to Garinol. Wilhelm, thou art a Bruja of surpassing splendor. Our grandsire Bruja himself would feel pride at this. In modesty, mistress, I could not have done it without Christoph's aid. Ain't that the truth? He has done well. Christoph performed admirably, my sire. I believe he is ready to know of the oncoming struggle. What struggle is this? The Jihad. The great war of all the vampire clans. The Zemitsi against the Tremere, and us against both. The Tremere? The Tremere were once a house of mages, part of the Order of Hermes. They stole Cain's gift from an ancient of our kind, an antediluvian, one of Cain's grandchildren. They seek to infiltrate and control all the world. They couple the power of Cain, with the ways of unspeakable magic. The fiends from the Carpathians, the Zemitsi, are fighting the Tremere even as we speak. 
The Zamitsi have invaded the ancestral homelands of the Ventru, which puts us in a strange alliance with the very Ventru who destroyed our great city of Carthage. So, we unite with the Vampire Prince of Prague, the Ventru Rudolf Brandl. For now. Thou hast reason to hate the Ventru as well, Christoph. Thou fell in battle against the pagan barbarians because the Ventru made puppets of thy leaders. The Ventru sent thee into battle to stop their Tsimitsi enemies. Most of the barbarians were revenants, ghoul servitors of the Tsimitsi. Other clans maintain havens here in Prague. Thou hast met the Cappadocians. The Nosferatu lurk below the graveyard in the northern quarter. Most of King Otakar's family, the Premisils, are Zemitsi ghouls. With the entrance of the Tremere into Prague, a struggle is bound to ensue, leaving the mortals greatly abused. We must avert this horror. Many in Prague have disappeared, including Bruja. We suspect they fell victim to the Zemitsi fiends or the usurping Tremere. We must stop the abductions. First, we must seek to undo the damage done by the traitorous Mercurio. Mistress, I wish to approach the Jewish quarter and warn the rabbi of Mercurio's meddling. If their golem hath suffered a cowardly attack, it may not be able to protect the Jews from the Tsimitsi. We have no alliance with the Kabbalists in the Jewish quarter, and they have powerful charms of faith to wield against our kind. We have a duty to protect the mortals. Should we deliver unto them this news, mayhap the Jews will owe us a boon. But we have much to do first. In three nights' time, thou may deliver thy message. Take Kristoff with thee, but beware. The Kabbalists have no love for the likes of us. Three nights' time may be too late. Three nights' time may be too late. After one mission with Wilhelm, thou hast become very like him. So be it. Wilhelm, take Kristoff to the Jewish quarter this night and warn the rabbi. Okay, so. Let me just check my notes here. So, what I've written is uh, to max awaken powers, uh, max healing power. Uh, feral, feral claws are strong. Theft of Vitae breaks the game. Uh, Prison of Ice for Mercurio. Okay, well, there you go. I, I didn't even get a chance to level before we got it. Um, appearance uh, is useless, so don't put anything into appearance. <clears throat> and manipulation is really good to have, especially when it comes to, like, bartering shit. Um... So we don't even have a lot of the stuff yet. So Dreadgates causes fear on the target. Yeah. Eyes of the Beast increases visual senses. Um, cost to learn Eyes of the Beast 1,562. Okay. So I'm guessing Eyes of the Beast just kind of makes things uh, apparent in the world. Like it probably highlights items. Um, potence... Grants increase automatic damage, celerity. So feed, we definitely want. Drains blood from uh, target a victim. Blood healing. We definitely want blood healing. Increases dexterity. So 437. So let's max out blood healing, because Jesus Christ. Feed. Okay, so we're maxed out on that. Um, I forgot what all this stuff does. I know that intelligence is worth it because intelligence basically, um, Is uh, intelligence basically makes your discipline stronger. Six 
699. Grants enhancement. Yeah. This one casts 20 blood. So let's do potence. Yeah, let's do that. Yeah, like some of the stuff I'll never use, like Eyes of the Beast, I don't think I'll ever get. Uh, Dread Gaze, I don't think I'll ever get. Oh, I don't think I'll ever pump more stuff in there, like more points. Blood Dexterity might be good, though. But I think this is good for now. Uh, oh, okay. So feral claws, earth melt, immerses the user into the earth, allowing safe rest. Hmm. His feral claws are definitely I, feral claws. It says are super strong, so definitely max that out uh, quickly. Um, and I'll guess I'll pump some into strength. Yeah, that's all I'm going to do. I've learned a new discipline group, Protean. Kill the golem. Destroy the golem that terrorizes the northern quarter. Destroy the golem? Well, I guess it'll be too late then. Okay. So let's save... Um, maybe let me talk to him one more time. Thou hast not yet completed thy tasks. Go ye hence, Kristoff. We shall speak more when thou art ready. Learn thy lessons well. Great words of wisdom, guys. So where am I going? The northern quarter. Where's the northern quarter? So we make a right and then another right. Okay. Oh, um, let's go to the thing first. The, um, the whatchamacallit. The blacksmith. Let's sell a lot of this shit. Good day to ye, young sir. Sell that. Damn. Okay, sell that. Here it's ten. That can be sold. Here it's fifteen. Five strength? Can't even tell. You have my hand on it. Tis a deal. Shit. Um. He has thirty-six strength. Yeah. Okay. Good day to you, young sir.
Uh, sell that. Do I want something better? What do these do? Lethal, bashing, and aggravated all ten. How much money do I have? Where's my money? 22.54. They get like a really nice... Like, uh... Weapon. Fine dagger. So, like, this is... 60 lethal. Well, this is 30 lethal. Lethal is 15, this is lethal 30. Hmm. Didn't you have, like, crazy weapons earlier. Good day to ye. Good day to ye, young sir. Well, I guess I'll get a great sword. Oh, minimum strength 55. I can't even use it. Broadsword is what I basically have. 25, speed 111. What I have is better. So I need 55 strength. Okay. Well, maybe some kind of armor at least for this guy. Maybe not that. Padded clothing. Forty-five lethal. Sure. Um and maybe some leather gloves. You have my hand on it. Tis a deal. Sorry, don't say I never gave you nothing, bro. Let's go see that uh, that other lady. The, um, I forgot what her, what her name was. But I crossed the bridge. Which now I don't even know where it is. That's the smithy, so... That one. Enorna shop. Uh, yeah, right there. Maybe I could sell those bottles to her. The milkmaid, eh? A comely young sister did come to me from the convent. A clever lass she was, and more valorous than many a young warrior. She bade me give thee this letter. Aww. Alright, let's see what it says. My dearest Kristoff. I have spoken to the old gypsy, a woman of great lore and learning. She hath told me much of the way of the Canites. Wow. She has heard that the soul is not truly lost after the horrid blood ceremony. There is hope even in unlife. The elder Canites know of the secret, and thou too may learn of it. I live for thy redemption. Thine in faith, Anezka. So not only did we tell her she was a va that we're a vampire, she now knows of the history. Well, a little bit of the history of the Hello, vampires. young one. What is it you... But hold. You do look so strangely. Ah, oh, they have hurt you. 
the canines have taken ye for their own. Oh, my poor boy. But fear not. Unorna neither feels ye nor casts ye out. I'll help ye. If I can. If I can. But only if I can. Uh, the holy water I'll keep. That you can sell. Uh, I don't know what this does. You can, you can have all that shit. Um... We'll walk the abyss. Elder Vitae, ooh. Plus 20 to all mental and physical attributes. Increase blood by 100. Is this like temporary? Let's plus five. I don't know if that's temporary or like, um, like permanent. I'm pretty sure it's only temporary. Otherwise, that's way too cheap. Like 1,790. That's way too fucking cheap. I would think like ten thousand at the or at like the the minimum. It's plus twenty. That's crazy. Uh, and you have that. You can sell that. You can sell that and that. And I can sell that as well. Do you buy rats by chance? No. Scroll of the Haunting. Uh, do you have Scroll of Identify by chance? Go with God, young one. Thank you. I think. I don't know if you just curse me or bless me. Uh, no. So we want to go past the Judith Bridge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, God forbid these guys actually, like, sheathe their weapons. So, we want to go on the other side, so just make a right, or left, and then another left. So it should be through there. Right there. Oh. That's not good. What did you say? The Golem Makaban? What? Um, let me put that there. Okay, let me... Nobody likes a messy inventory. I don't know why I kept the torch, to be honest. Go 
over there. And you have nothing. Alright. Alright, dead end. Mendel. Save us! Our own golem has gone mad! Can the rabbi control this brute? Yes, but the rabbi is dead. Oof. I am his son, Mendel. Tell me how to kill the golem, Mendel. The golem's life cometh from truth. Thou speakest riddles. The word truth hath been writ upon a scroll and placed within the brow of the creature. The Hebrew word for truth and the word for death are but a single letter apart. Destroy that one letter and the creature falls in death. So we have to destroy a letter? Um, okay, I'm, sp I'm guessing it's through that way. Oh, excuse me. Is that staircase that leads to nowhere? Oh, I can't even go up there. I can't even go anywhere in there. Okay, so this area is pointless. Is that it? Makaba the Golem. Let's let's do a quick save here. Well done, sir. Ah! Holy shit. <laughs> Let's let's try that again. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, shit. Right then. Clearly missing something here. I am clearly missing something. No, no, no. Uh. Oh, okay. Oh, 
Joseph. Alright, you know, let me reload. Maybe you just... <sighs> well, um... Stand thy ground. Don't fight. To awaken this guy? No. Why can I not talk to him? Do we seriously need to fight this thing? I stand. Yeah, you you wait here. And it's stuck. Or not. Maybe I should have kept my um, ranged weapons. Okay, I don't think he's following me anymore. I think I'm meant to fight him. Turn to thee.
beast awakens. Find the foe. Oh, shit. To the abyss with thee. Okay, yeah, I think I'm supposed to actually kill him. Lovely. Well, I think that's going to do it for this episode, because I think I've had enough for now. Because um, I've been playing basically three episodes straight, and I'm, I'm done. Uh, I don't know how we're going to beat this guy, but if I beat Mercurio, I'm sure I can beat this fucker. In the meantime, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one. Take care.